you want to make a change in your life, it starts with uh, one thing, and that's getting up mm -hmm. and, and doing it. That's the hardest part. Like mm -hmm. all the trainers say, the hardest part about getting into routine or about going to a class is getting up to go to them. Hey guys, my name is Amelia, and today we are here with Jim Cass at 45 Training. Today our guest is Melissa. She is a former soccer player and athlete. How are you today, Melissa? Good. Okay, so let's go. A lot of us do struggle with physical activity and you seem to be very motivated. Can you give us <laughs> advice on how even me can be more motivated to wake up early in the morning and really get a workout in, a run in, or a yoga session because a lot of us struggle no, <laughs> with totally. just the motivation aspect, you know? Totally. It's I think it's about goal setting and finding what makes you feel good. So if you like to do yoga, if you like to meditate, if you like to strength train, if you like to run, if you like to walk, anything, mm -hmm. like every anybody can do anything active just as long as you, you get up and do it. I think the hardest part of staying motivated is to commit. It's that constant yes. commitment. So say you have your Monday through Sunday goals or Monday through Friday goals, like every day this week, I wanna walk for 45 minutes, then write it down. And then when you're done with it, check it off because it feels so good. Not only yeah. when you finish with it, but when you, when check, you check it, it off. off. Yeah. What do you think about the importance of physical health on mental health? I think everybody has their own way of being physically good and mentally good as well, um, just depending on what really makes you happy. But if you enjoy doing something like even writing or um, something that's not exactly working out or going to the gym, I think that you have to do you and, and do what's important to you, what you like to do, what really will set you up to, to be mentally okay. So we've talked a lot about the things that you do like about physical activity. Tell us some of the things you don't like. I mean, who likes burpees? <laughs> I hate True. burpees, I hate burpees. I just don't like that, that pressure sometimes that's put on that. So it's always good just to know that you could, you know, uh, create an, an adaptive, uh, type of exercise similar to what they're telling you to do. Okay. Just know what's better for, for you personally in, in your body. We're at the end of our segment and our last workout. Thank you so much, Melissa, for joining us today. And don't forget to subscribe, like, and comment down below. Also, make sure to join us in our next activity. Thank you for joining us. Bye. Make sure you check in. <laughs> See you then. Bye.